Let's find the area of the region bounded by the graphs of f of x equals x and g of x equals 2x squared. The region can be found graphically fairly easily because these are two simple functions. This is f of x equals 2x, just a line y equals x, and this is g of x equals 2x squared. So it comes down like that, goes up, and we see that the region is right here enclosed by the two functions. We need to find point of intersection here and point of intersection here. This is the graph, the top function f of x equals x. And this right here is g of x equals 2x squared. So we set them equal, x equals 2x squared. We can also do it by inspection. 0 equals 2x squared minus x. Factor out x, and then x times x minus 1. We see the x-coordinates are 0 and 1. So the area would equal to the integral from 0 to 1, the top function, x, minus the function on the bottom, which is x squared. And these are simple integrals. We end up with 1 half x squared minus 1 third x cubed, evaluated from 0 to 1. We plug in 1, get 1 half minus one-third, that's equal to 3 over 6 minus 2 over 6, which is equal to 1 over 6. And that's the answer. That's the area. Now we can also do this another way by integrating with respect to uh, y. Now let's take a look at that just quickly. Um, once again, I'm going to graph this region. So this is the line y equals 2x. This is the parabola. And this is y equals 2x. So x equals to y. This is y equals to x squared. So if I solve for x, x equals to square root of y. And then y ranges between 0 and 1. So if we integrate with respect to y, we're sort of looking at this from left to right instead of from bottom to the top. The area will be the integral from 0 to 1 also. The function on the right is square root of y minus the function on the left, which is y. And we integrate this with respect to y. Square root of y is y to the 1 half. So the integral of y to the 1 half is going to be y to the 3 halves divided by 3 halves minus 1 half y squared evaluated from 0 to 1 and this is equal to let's write it like this 2 thirds y to the 3 halves minus 1 half y squared evaluated from 0 to 1 and this is 2 thirds minus 1 half now 2 thirds is 4 over 6 1 half is 3 over 6, and the answer still is 1 over 6. And so the integral can be done, both the area can be computed using integration with respect to x and also with respect to y, and the answer is 1 6.